This video looks at a little proof involving sec and cosec. Now sec is 1 over cos, so sec squared is 1 over cos squared theta. Now cosec is 1 over sine, so cosec squared is 1 over sine squared theta. Now to add these two fractions together requires the same denominator. So if I times the left fraction by sine squared, I get sine squared theta over cos squared theta sine squared theta, and I'll times the right fraction by cos squared, so cos squared theta over cos squared theta sine squared theta. The two fractions now share the same denominator. So this becomes sine squared theta plus cos squared theta all over cos squared theta sine squared theta. Now cos squared theta plus sine squared theta equals 1, that is the fundamental identity. So it's 1 over cos squared sine squared. But 1 over cos is sec, and 1 over sine is cosec, so therefore this equals cosec squared theta sec squared theta by definition. 1 over sine squared, 1 over cos squared.